So today I made an 808 sample pack using eight different 808 samples and uh, these were just eight of my favorite samples that I um, converted into WAV files and I have um, the WAV files with the kick and then without the kick as well and then the kick itself if you decide to use that in a song. And um, I also made an instrument rack for Ableton with all these 808s in it. Um, but first, I'm just going to go ahead and sample or play through these so that you can hear what you're, you're getting. Alright, so that's with the kick. And that was without the kick. And then there's the kick itself. Um, so that's the sample pack. And uh, believe it or not, it's actually pretty hard to find different 808 samples because a lot of the sample packs that are already out use all the same 808s and it's just confusing um, but here's the instrument rack for Ableton users and um, one thing I forgot to mention is that all of these 808s in the pack and then in the instrument rack are tuned to the note of C which uh, makes it so that you don't have to transpose them in a sampler if you're using another DAW um, but the instrument rack allows you to play these um, 808s with your MIDI keyboard and uh, they don't have the kick in front of them so you have to choose your own kick to put in front of the samples or just use the ones I provided or the one that I have provided in the pack um, but down here in the instrument rack you have access to the release, the sustain, the decay and the attack, and the glide time because um, this is also legato so you can slide your nodes up and down and um, right here you have the selector and as you can see in the bottom left corner when you turn this the, the sample will change to whichever one it's on and like I said, all of these are tuned to C pretty perfectly. And uh, you can see the tuner malfunction sometimes, but they're all basically at C. Um, and uh, yeah, when you hold down the, the notes in the sampler, they'll just loop infinitely. So you don't have to worry about that. And I did all the crossfading and everything. Um, but yeah, if you download either of these or, or like it at all, um, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more packs and instrument racks and stuff like that. Um, this took me about three or four hours to make, and uh, it was it was pretty fun making it. But a like would be greatly appreciated, and um, yeah, I'll have a demo song. Um, using one of the 808s at the end of this video and uh, I think I used the saturated one in a sampler um, so yeah hopefully you enjoy this or um, learn something or gain some kind of value out of this video um, enjoy the pack and the song at the end Thanks for watching.